All right, for the third painting, we're going to have just a really simple sailboat on top of a lake uh, with mountains in the background, kind of break it up, kind of your classical sailboat on a lake. Um, it's going to be sunset, so you're going to have this orange reflected in the water, obviously, with the blue in the water. So I'll have this blue, green, uh, blue. So I'll probably have to alternate back and forth between layers to get that color just right. And uh, yeah, first we'll just land kind of the lake in the sunset and then we'll see where it goes next layer. All right, so the question today is who is Frank Webb? Titanium white, Mars black, Quinn red, Pearly red, Primary yellow, Yellow ochre, Van Dyke brown, Burn umber, Fela green, Quinn blue, Ultramarine blue. still wet but we kind of got what we want um, we have the sunset sky it's kind of start very neutral light um, very unusual um, you do see these colors but it's just kind of weird not to paint blue in the sky right uh, we have the same reflection here we're gonna have this kind of rosy uh, sunset obviously a little bit darker here it goes to purple here you're not seeing it there but that's okay because that's kind of you're getting farther out from the light so the lights going away from you um, you got the blue sky mountains are going to make that maybe a little more gray, uh, a little more, maybe, yeah, a little bit more gray, I think. Uh, we got the boat. I've laid it in as green. That's a nice contrast to this boat. Um, I think in the picture it's white, but, you know, you can paint it any color you want, basically. So for the sake of the painting, I want to have this nice contrast um, orange to green. The mass is covered up, but I'll add it back in later after we finish the sky when I get that clean because it's going to be easier to cut in with the sky finish. <laughs> So Frank Webb was a famous, well he is, he's still alive, he's 92. Uh, he's a famous watercolor painter and you know he worked a long time in the ad agency um, and did painting on the side, similar to how I worked in finance work, did painting on the side. And then when he got close to retirement, he decided to uh, paint full time and develop a lot of courses for watercolor. So he's really well known as a teacher of watercolor medium and so that's what who frank webb is that's my question of the day all right we just finished the painting let's take a closer look so i have this nice sky um, it's really this neutral sky i added a little bit of purple clouds in there to kind of create a little bit of tension um, again the um, background is going to be that purple kind of reflection of the sunset along with the really brilliant red on the water which is really cool unless you've seen it you wouldn't believe it but yeah the water will totally f reflect that especially when the rays are really low um, when you're higher up in the sun it's going to reflect more of the sky not necessarily um, those brilliant colors um, it's always a reflection but you know when you get higher up in the sky you're gonna have kind of those darker blues popping through while as you get lower in the sky you're gonna get really the sunset a lot of the sunset colors are gonna really pop through 
Um, there might have been a little bit more darker blue in this, but I decided just to leave it as is. Um, the mask is okay. I could have done it a lot sharper. Um, I probably should have used tape. Uh, got a little lazy at the end, um, which is kind of stupid because then it kind of ruins the painting when you did a pretty decent job. It's not the best out of the four, but you know I like the sky pretty much. I think that's okay. Hopefully you guys like it. If you want to subscribe, you can subscribe below. And I'll see you in the next painting review. Thanks for watching, guys.